Hi folks, welcome to Pranayama Practice. Today we will focus on Nadi Shodhana. Uh, the Pranayama practices in general are breath control practices that give us tools for building a bridge between mind and body. So as we explore this and any Pranayama practice, you're invited to bring awareness to how it um, affects the mind, affects your body, and the bridge and connection between the two. Hey, Black Yogis, check out my shirt. This is not a cult. If you would like to be a supporter in our renovation of our yoga studio, click the link in the description box to purchase your t-shirt. This is not a cult to help support the renovations of the studio. All proceeds go to the renovations of our yoga studio in Birmingham, Alabama. Nadi Shodhana is a practice that has um, a variety of approaches. Today we will be doing the most basic Nadi Shodhana. It is the most accessible to the most people. This uh, pranayama practice is ideal for clearing energy channels, for calming and balancing your systems, um, and is specifically a tool for uh, finding balance between the uh, energy channels of your body, the feminine uh, or ida nadi and the masculine pingala nadi um, on either side of your energy self. And it actually translates into English the name into channel cleansing breath. So nadi is channel, shodhana is that cleansing, and the pranayama breath practice is the tool we use for it. Um, I mentioned that it is an accessible practice. With that said, it is not uh, useful for you, perhaps, if you are um, ill. So if you today find yourself with a cold or the flu or bronchitis, anything respiratory, congestion, mucus, uh, please skip this practice today and come back to it when you are free of that um, pressure on your respiratory system. Similarly, if you have a chronic condition like asthma, this isn't a practice that is ideal for you. So please consult other practices that are better fit. Um, with that said, we are going to focus today, as I mentioned, on the basic Nadi Shodhana. This is um, not the alternate nostril breathing you may have heard of. If you are seeking alternate nostril, that uh, practice is just as a warning, not a good fit for folks with heart conditions. So today you are welcome if you have heart challenges um, to join us, but just be mindful of the effects on your body and always follow yourself and the wisdom of your own body and what is best for you. I will ask you to join me on the mat uh, or the pillow or wherever you can find a comfortable seated place. Sukhasana is the uh, sana that I'm sitting in, easy pose. Um, knees crossed and legs crossed in front of me, knees facing forward. Uh, Flotus is in your practice, uh, Padmasana with the feet up in your groin, that's welcome. If neither of those is able is possible for you, please feel free to put your feet out in front um, or find another comfortable meditative asana for your um, body. The invitation for your left hand is to just help you ground down and anchor. So bring your left thumb and your left index finger together in a circle. Let those other fingers relax and place the palm on your left knee in Jan Mundra. Your right hand will be active in this practice. And I will talk you through what we will be doing with the right hand. And then we will set up and do um, a series of rounds together of the Nadi Shodhana. The right hand, um, all the thumb and ring finger will be active um, around your nostrils and the pointer or index finger and middle finger will be helping bring that psychic connection to your third eye center. So you'll take your hand, place it in front of your face, palm facing towards your um, face, bring the left, the thumb just along the right nostril, 
and the ring finger just along the left nostril. Your pinky finger can relax and place your index finger and middle finger at your third eye center. Find your breath as we get set up. Just connect to your deep breath in and out. Nadi Shodhana will be practiced with your mouth closed. So you can close your mouth now and just find your yogic breath with your hand on your face, nothing closing your nostrils. Just breathe in deeply through both nostrils and exhale completely. To begin the practice, place your thumb on the right nostril and allow the breath to come in and out of your left nostril. Breathe in through the left nostril only. And exhale through the left nostril only. Continue with that for five more breaths. In on the left. Out on the left. Lower your gaze. In on the left. Out on the left. In on the left. Out on the left. In on the left. And exhale on the left. Now switch. Place your ring finger on the left nostril. Open the right nostril. Lift your thumb. Breathe in on the right. Mouth closed, exhale through the right nostril. Five more breaths here. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale. Exhale and inhale one more time. Exhale. Lower your right hand to your right knee. Breathe in through both nostrils, mouth closed. Exhale through the nose. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. This completes the first round. Notice any changes in your body as you continue normal breathing. You can continue to keep your gaze low or your eyes closed. Notice any sensations. Round two, raise your right hand again, thumb along your right nostril, ring finger along your left nostril, Index and middle finger resting on your third eye center, above and between your eyebrows. Close your right nostril with your thumb and breathe in on the left to begin round two. Out on the left. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, allow relaxation over your body. Inhale, exhale, and switch to the right. Close your left nostril with your ring finger and inhale on the right. Lift your thumb. Exhale on the right. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale on the right. Exhale on the right. Notice any sensation. Inhale on the right. 
Exhale on the right. One more breath on the right in. And exhale on the right nostril. Lower your right hand to your right knee and breathe in through both nostrils. Exhale through the nose. Inhale. Exhale, release. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Last breath in through the nose. And exhale. Return to normal breathing. Notice your body. Observe your mind. Notice any connection between the two. And stay here as long as you'd like. Thank you for joining me today for Nadi Shodana Pranayama.